strange to say this, but the Olympics, uh, they're right around the corner. Yeah. And some Olympic hopefuls, they want you to count down the days with them. So the men's USA bobsled team, they are selling some... Um, steamy calendars to help raise money for their sport, actually. And BC10's Miguel Martinez Valle, he traveled to Lake Placid to give you this Christmas present. We wanted to do something where they get to see a little more of us and maybe a lot more of us. The men's USA bobsled team is known for keeping their cool on the ice. But they're turning up the heat this holiday season with a gift so hot, it could melt their course. Leaving it all out there, some people went all naked, some people didn't. Bob Sledder and photographer Jimmy Reed came up with the idea of a steamy calendar to raise funds and raise the team's profile. We've wanted to make a calendar for a long time. We often feel like uh, Bob Sledders aren't very well known because we have our helmets on and our speed suits. So they bared it all on and off the ice. We're excited because you know, we've been trying to raise funds all year and we raise a lot of funds for our team. and. This is just an, another way to, to help that out, and what better way to do it by, you know, getting on the calendar and giving the people what they want. The posing, a nice escape from the grueling training it takes to make it to the 2022 Winter Olympics. We're a really close team. Uh, everyone gets along great. We're all pitching in, and so it's it kind of fun, a fun project to do outside of training and sliding just to make the season a little lighter. Carlos Valdez, one of the models, is also one of the most experienced members of the team. This is the second go around and my last go around, so you know I'm really looking forward to seeing how much of that work is going to pay off even more, and you know hopefully we turn that into a medal. He says to get to Beijing, teamwork is everything. It's huge. It's super important, especially from a team standpoint and four mans. So the team keeps working together, pushing each other to perform in the upcoming races, hoping the hard work pays off in February. It'll be pretty stressful and competitive up until that point, but we're ready for the season. And hoping fans enjoy using them to count down the days. I couldn't think of a better Christmas gift, a better bachelorette party gift, if you lose your fantasy football league. Miguel Martinez Valle, NBC 10 News. Got some ice water in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. U.S. boss. Okay. Team. All, right. all right. Hey, look. All the money it raised goes to a good cause. So that's that's that. We are two married women. We do Woo. not need to be talking about that. Steve Sosna, where are you? It's Christmas <laughs> Eve, though. We're allowed that's to, like, you that's know. Your gift. Come it's on. a gift. It, it is a gift. It supports the team. Miguel keeps on giving, us. too. Each, each the gift each that one keeps one on too. giving. Miguel's like, you know, not a bad assignment, ladies. Not a bad assignment. <laughs> Mr. Marsh. There you go. We know who was working out during COVID now. Yeah, right. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you won't be seeing us in our bathing suits anytime yeah. soon.